think this is a tropical paradise. But it's this bloke's front garden in Essex. This bloke being Stephen Wheeler of Wheelham Caravans, and the front garden being the forecourt of the one-time garage in which he and his brother oh, Ian build these amazing little caravans. They are tiny, they are cute, but they're not toys or gimmicks, as I think you'll quickly see. We spent the day with the wheelers, and I make no apologies for this, our longest ever, but I hope seriously interesting report. We're in sunny Essex today, and we're looking at the wheel home. It's amazing. It's a little box, five and a half feet wide, by nine feet long, made of glass fibre, and once you've said that, you haven't even started, because the minute they get the box, they start to put so much stuff in it, you can't believe it. The caravan itself is really tiny, but you don't feel cramped. There's a lifting roof, so you can actually stand upright without any problems at all. There's a window in the back of the roof section. There's a vent in either side, so you've got light and some air. Once you get inside the little caravan, you've got everything you need. There's a proper two burner cooker. There's a proper sink. There's a proper 12 volt fridge. There's everything that you need inside this small space. It's designed exclusively for two people. You couldn't get four people to sleep in here uh, unless they were very tiny and they slung a hammock across or something silly. It's not going to work. The whole idea behind the caravan is to get as much as you can in terms of storage space and accommodation inside this tiny space. Standing right at the back of the caravan, I've got the lifting roof section behind me. And I'm looking forward, there's two seats. Both the seats actually convert into single beds. They pull right the way out. If you want to see it done properly, here's an expert, who's also the designer and half the building team. But after a few nights spent here, I'm sure you'd find putting up the beds just as easy. This is with the seats down in the bed position. The beds are actually about six foot six long, but obviously the, the end uh, right at the sloping end is not fully usable. You can get your feet up there, and if you're laying on your side, I guess you'll be able to use a full six foot six. With your st toes sticking up in the air, you probably couldn't. There's a reading light right beside you, which is an optional extra, but there aren't many optional extras on this caravan because so much is actually supplied as standard. Tons of space in the caravan, and it's all generated by the, I guess by the ingenuity of two guys, Ian and Stephen Wheeler. Stephen is a designer, and we're going to have a chat with him in a minute and see where he got all these ideas from, because the caravan is full of ideas, and they're all good, they all work.